Hey Leo, welcome to your weekend read for June 9th through the 12th. Get into the energies for this weekend. Earlier this week, we had that 6-6 six, six portal. Coming up in a couple of days, we have Venus conjunct Uranus, both in Taurus. So let's see what this all means for you, Leo. All of this mean to you. We have the Nine of Coins. <clears throat> Sorry, my battery's low, but I'm gonna finish you anyway. Your battery might be running low right now. Um, you might be working really hard, which is not always a bad thing. You might be working extensively on something. Um, we have the Page of Coins, the Lovers, and the Page of Cups. Okay, so the obvious, for some of you, there's a love interest that is igniting you. Um, to better things, to greater things. I think you're realizing something maybe about some people that you've had around you. Um, <clears throat> everything's starting to look really differently and it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Okay, it's gonna put you in an elevated position. Um, for right now, I think you could be happier with your money and you could be happier with, dare I say, your relationship. I just, uh, this is almost, I'm getting like a Four of Cups vibe while seeing this. And oh, Leo, okay. I'm going to shuffle. <clears throat> this is a lot for a weekend, but I mean, that's okay. Okay, so we have the Empress on the bottom. The Two of Cups in reverse. Yeah, okay, and the Five of Coins. All right, so um, that relationship I was saying might be pushing you in a direction, might be a, in a direction away from them. Um, if it's not a romantic situation, just apply what makes sense to you. If that's work, um, most of you, yeah, it's a relationship that's not fun anymore. And, you know, your money is not where you want to, <laughs> you're not feeling the love and the emotional connection. Maybe a little bit. I don't think you dislike this person, but there might be moments, there's probably moments where you're just like, what the fuck am I doing? Like, where are we going with this and why? Um, I think you're feeling yourself. You might have been doing some inner work and surrounding yourself with other people that do give you uh, a breath of fresh air. Let's look more at this. Obviously, this is what we all need to hear. So, okay. Love and money. Love and money. And the Ace of Coins. So, Leo, are you mad? How do I want to say this? I don't want to be a dick because I love you. I don't want to be a dick. <laughs> are you mad at your money situation? Like, are you resentful um, towards someone else because of where you are? Or are you taking out your resentments by getting just mad money revenge <laughs> and doing for yourself and being that star of whatever industry you're in? whatever it is you love doing. Um, 
I do feel like this person's been interfering on and off or maybe you just feel like they're interfering. Whatever it is, the connection that you two have, um, you feel like it's holding you back in some degree, whether you're saying this stuff out loud or not. Um, and if you're not saying it out loud, you're probably expressing it in many other ways. Not that you would be afraid to say it. Uh, I don't think you'd be afraid to say it. I just think it's not serving you in the way you intend for it to. Uh, yeah, let me say that. <clears throat> okay, more for Leo. What's going on with Leo in this situation? got the seven of cups <clears throat> you could be confused about moving forward how you want to handle things um what you want to be known i think you're hiding a lot of pain or stress at least from the public eye you don't want to seem like you are a mess in any way not you don't want to seem like you're a mess in the ways that you feel are a mess right now um you want that to be private you don't want people to know uh you know what's really going on i see i see a mask and it's a happy mask and you're crying behind it uh i don't like that energy for you and I don't think you like it either and if you're not crying it is but I mean yeah then you're you're angry you're upset um and it's just it's coming from this confusion it's coming from confusion in your home life or relationship or whatever y'all are doing there and I think you're just uh you know sort of building this building this wall like building this um perhaps stage for yourself for the future and i don't see anything wrong with that either um but if there are you know if you build something out of anger is it gonna be as sustainable as building something from just a happier frequency okay I think, I think that's good for Leo. Yeah, it's just a lot of, um, a lot of memories of how things used to be. Uh, you might feel like you're working really hard for something that you used to have because you're trying to recreate that. Um, just recreate those scenarios where things were really good and you did have the, the love and the money and the life uh, that you wanted. So that's all gonna come up this weekend and you, you are uh, gonna be faced with some arguments that could happen. The Three of Wands, we have the King of Swords on the bottom here, okay. I think once you decide that you, this confusion is over, that you are clear on where you stand. Um, it's gonna be hard for anything to really get in your way. I think the confusion is what's uh, holding you back. Any confusion that you have, um, and sometimes we just need to stop obsessing over why over why something happened or why you know how did we get here like what was the path of events leading to this like i was just blindsided and that's that's what i'm feeling from leo but um i don't think you were blindsided i think you're just finding a new perspective of yourself of your other people and saturn's moving in retrograde for the next five months okay so if you're doing something right now that you know you shouldn't be doing and you know you are taking your pain out on someone else and you are projecting um it's gonna come back and bite you and uh and then you're gonna you're you're not gonna feel good about it 
Um, but when you're clear and you do know what you want and you want this type of life, you want this type of person, you want this type of job, um, I don't think anything, like I said, nothing's gonna get in your way, but you. Okay, <laughs> I think that's enough for Leo. Um, this is only four days, we'll talk more later. If you want to think of your yes or no question, you can do that now and pause if you need to. We'll have the answer when you come back. So Leo, if you have a yes or no question, ask that now and get you an answer. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's a no, Leo, to whatever question you asked. I hope this reading was really helpful for you, Leo. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. Um, if you're feeling generous, share this video with someone you think would find value in this. And yeah, let me know how you resonated in the comments. I would love to hear from you. I have personal readings available. If you like what I'm doing, what we're doing here, subscribe and hit your bell notifications. And I'll see you soon. Bye.